want some onion rings? For vegan onion rings. <laughs> Ow. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're back here in the onion burg. I don't know, I got onion rings, so I just had to. Um, today I'm going to be talking about a single image for like, I don't know how long. Um, the official Hey Bloxburg Twitter posted another sneak peek. It's not, a, you know, technically a teaser because teasers are kind of just like the things that lead up to an update. Sneak peeks are kind of like almost, almost teaser like pretty much, but um, they just give us an idea of what they're currently working on. And I guess you could call it a teaser. It's a sneak peek though. So we're gonna look at that today. We're gonna talk about it and kind of give some um, guesses and predictions on what the next update will be about because this is obviously our next update hint. So yeah. Okay, I'm magical. I just, you know, the onion ring just hovers into my, my mouth. All right, okay, here we are. So here is the official Welcome to Bluxburg Twitter. I'll be putting this in the description. I don't think you need an account to view what they post, but it might bother you like, hey, you need to make an account. But um, yes, so as you can see, 10 hours ago, I know I'm kind of slow on this. I don't really rush to get like videos out on like their sneak peeks teasers, I guess. But today they said a little something we're deconstructing. So as you can see, they are currently in like Blender, which is like the modeling program, I guess. I think it's Blender. Could be, could be something else. But um, yeah, as you can see, they're basically designing a couch. And as you can see, there's like a little spring coming out of the side here. So it's kind of like a, it's like breaking down, you know, like this is like a worn out, torn couch. It's, as you can see, it's very lopsided as well. Like this side's just going down. This thing has been sat on for years. <laughs> I do like the design of it though, like it's pretty like simple, it's simple, I like the design of it. That's all we're seeing today though, this is the only image that I'm going to be talking about. Here's a, like a bigger image, oh this is so much better, yeah, um, this is just like their cursor right here of them, just a couch. Nothing more. So this just brings me to like the theme, I guess, like for the furniture that we're getting the next update is going to be like, I want to say like homeless, like broken down, worn out furniture could be the theme i think it might be it might be pretty interesting you know like we always have like these normal perfect couches that are like not broken down and stuff so it's kind of interesting to have like a like a messed up looking couch that's kind of cool i like because it's also kind of realistic as well like if you have a couch that's been you know sitting in your house for years eventually it's gonna wear down get torn down i don't know it's not gonna be the best so it's cool to have like this type of theme furniture as well i'm looking through the comments right now a lot of people are saying the crafting skill you know crafting crafting but i'm not sure if this is related to crafting at all but they did say it's deconstructing so that's something right oh i think this would be perfect for like haunted houses and stuff or just like abandoned homes in general or something because messed up couch perfect for like halloween houses i love how we're thinking about halloween like eight months from now oh my gosh my couch i also just okay wait i just realized down here there's books that is kind of like balancing on you know wait those are books right you have one leg here one support leg and then you have books <gasps> I love the detail in that though. That is really neat. The spring and the books. Why did it take me so long? Maybe it's because it's all blended. It's not like colored or textured yet. Okay, I see you, Blockbird. The detail. The detail. I can see this being used in role plays as well. Like people are moving into their houses and get rid of the like used up looking couch. That's our teaser. That's our little, not teaser. That's our sneak peek. Eventually we're going to get more teasers leading up to the next update. I actually don't know when it's going to happen. I don't think it's this week. I'm guessing it's going to come out potentially in a week or two. When was the last time we got an update? I'm not gonna count the little hot fix. I'm assuming it's gonna be like next Thursday or the week after that. So either March 7th or March 14th is when I believe we're gonna be getting the, potentially getting the next update. That's my guesses. It's not an answer because the last time we got an update was February 8th. Four weeks would be 7th, March 7th, and then the five weeks that we normally are used to would be March 14th. That's just my guesses on when the next update may come out if we're following the five week Thursday patterns. But I'm thinking we may get some more like broken down looking furniture just kind of as like a theme like a makeshift i'm just gonna call it makeshift honestly other than that i have nothing else to really to to guess it'd be so funny if we got like a broken down looking vehicle too but i kind of doubt that because i mean it'd be kind of be kind of pointless i don't think many people would buy like a broken down looking car it would be like one thousand or two thousand dollars and be kind of slow but I, I i doubt that I don't think they would ever do something like that. It'd be great, you know? Perfect roleplay opportunity right there. What else could they add to be like broken down? Also, this brings me to another idea is that um, St. Patrick is like almost here. You guys know March, what, what day is St. Patrick's Day? March 17th? March 17th, of course I, knew, I remember that. So do you think for the first time ever, we may get something related to 
that day because yeah st patty's day is like another word for it where you have to wear green usually in school like if you wear green you're safe from being pinched but if you don't wear green people pinch you i don't know exactly where that came from potentially some like food ideas or like furniture ideas i don't know we've never had one before like and we never had an update related to that before so i'm not sure if we'll ever get one i don't know it's just never been done same thing with like easter we you normally don't get easter updates we don't get um easter and st patrick's day we never get updates but we do get one we do get a valentine's one so it'd be interesting okay i'm looking at potential food ideas this is a charcuterie board idea just have a bunch of fruit and i think like vegetables like peas in a pod i see some like kiwi you know a fun little charcuterie oh it's a rainbow i just realized <laughs> a little rainbow charcuterie board there's also like this cheese it m m what is that potatoes there you go same oh popcorn they got st patrick's day popcorn up in here there's many ideas you know there's some drink ideas the ideas are endless if they would like to add any of those things i'm just gonna say we may not even get anything related to it i'm also just hoping for a fancy furniture like revamp eventually i'm sure many of us like i think majority of blocksburg players want a revamp for fancy furniture i'm pretty sure all of us just want a revamp for every single like their building that's not blocksburger or the uh gym uh, and they like actually make more mini game type of jobs that'd be so fun because i still love blocksburger i think blocksburger is one of my favorite revamps ever the gym was all right like i love i love this little front desk area pretty cool um and then equipment and the yoga studio but blocksburger still has my like favorite because of the new foods and the new jobs there's so many like positions there's like six jobs technically here i do hope if we do get like a uh fancy furniture uh update revamp maybe there's like a job that comes here too like you could sell furniture or something to people and if there's like a bff supermarket revamp we can actually like scan people's items like realistically instead of pressing a button like you could actually scan items <laughs> and like restock stuff and put things on shelves and whatnot that'd be super fun i don't know real life jobs in video games are just much more fun but yeah that is all i have to talk about for today sorry i ramble too much um i haven't made a video in like two days i'm just taking a little break here from blockburg until i guess our next update there's that if you have any um blocksburg ideas let me know in the comments. I am slowly trying to get back in the building mood again because I get burnt out so easily from building stuff. But I think I may have an idea for my next build. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think in the comments on what we may get for the next update. Um, what are you hoping for? Do you think we'll get St. Patrick's Day? Do you think um, the update's like next week or in two weeks? I don't know. Say everything. <laughs> I hope it's an exciting one, though. I hope it's a very exciting one. That's all. But yeah, thanks for watching. Have a great day. I'm out. Goodbye. I'm running. I'm running away. Goodbye. I did. I did warn you guys from the very beginning. I was going to talk about this one thing for a whole video. I never. I never lie about that. At least.